Sisters of Mary School is an institution that uh, caters the poorest of the poor students mm -hmm. of the country. The school existed primarily to uh, help in the alleviation of uh, these poor students, uh, give them education, free education, mm -hmm. uh, so that they could be they could prepare for a better future, mm -hmm. and at the same time, help them prepare to help their families as well. Nagsimula po ito noong 1964 sa Korea. Okay. Tinatag ni Monsignor Aloysius Suarez na ngayon, ang tawag na po natin is Venerable Aloysius Suarez. Ah. So pagka April, mm -hmm. dinadala sila ng mga magulang dito. Okay. Then, tatanggapin namin, dito na sila titira. Okay. So, meron silang sarili-sariling dormitory. Mm -hmm. Mag makakasama rin nila yung ibang mga bata o mga estudyante. Okay. Then, mag meron din silang tinatawag na sister in charge mm -hmm. sa floor na yan. Okay. It's the sister's role to do the recruitment. Okay. Uh, around August or September, mm -hmm. they start already the recruitment. And uh, usually, uh, sisters would coordinate with the parish priest where they or catechists they will be recommended by the parish priest. Okay. What we are doing is we first is we communicate with the bishop. Ah, okay. By diocese po. Okay. Then yung sina bishop naman, ang mga bishop kakausapin nila yung mga parishes. Mm -hmm. mga pare. Mm -hmm. After yung parishes naman po kakausapin nila yung catechist right. or and marami po doon, mga principal, uh -huh. mga, mga su district supervisors. And Almost every year they look forward to having the financial literacy, especially mm -hmm. if they belong to the next line of graduating students. Yes. I think the most uh, that could help us really determine or evaluate the mm -hmm. impact of the financial literacy are students who, are, who went out already from mm -hmm. JP uh -huh. and how they experience uh, budgeting, right. uh -oh. prioritizing expenses of what is needed and what That's is wants. Talagang nakikita namin kailangan matutunan ng mga bata ito mm -hmm. yung financial literacy kasi pag, pag lumalabas sila, mm -hmm. hindi nila minsan alam kung papaano gagamitin ang mga, ang mga very small resources that they have okay. and then paglabas po nila dito na sana po sila limang mm -hmm. taon mahigit limang taon na everything is provided for them right mula mm -hmm. sa pinaka simpleng gamit sa katawan hanggang sa pagkain mm -hmm. hanggang sa pag-aaral so ngayon po yung financial literacy makakatulong po talaga sa kanila yun kasi alam po nila kung paano nila i-manage yung kung ano man ang matatanggap nila right oh, pag sila ay nag-OJT na pag oh, sila ay nagtrabaho na Maraming maraming salamat sa partnership at uh, uh, hopefully in the next uh, few years may pagpatuloy pa natin itong ginagawa natin at ayun, makapagbigay pa kami ng resources, hindi lang ng training and more books no? for, the <laughs> for the students and teachers. No? Nakalimutan ko yung uh, teachers. So yun, sister, maraming maraming salamat po. Thank you. Uh, Ma'am Nelsie. Thank you din, sir. Thank you. Yeah.